how to replace the license file uh, with your installation of ScanViewer, the scanning software for your ScanTech scanner. So you've either got a license file on the silver thumb drive uh, that came with your ScanTech scanner. In the case, I'm going to plug mine in here. It's going to pop up. Uh, or you've got a file that you've uh, been sent from Digitize, either as an email attachment or as uh, in a Dropbox link. So if you've got that USB drive, plug that in. It'll look like this. If you've got that file from an email or a Dropbox link, download that and throw it on the desktop like I've got here. So we'll navigate into this folder, into this set folder. And so here's that RGF file in question. Yours is going to have a slightly different number that matches the serial number on your scanner. And so one of these two, either that or this. That's where we're going to pull that uh, file from here in just a moment. That's where we're going to put that. It's going to be in the installation directory scan viewer. So if you've already installed the program, you've got one of these two shortcuts on your desktop. So I'll show you both of those. I'm going to right click on uh, whichever one you've got and click open file location. It's going to be the quickest way to get us to that install directory. If you do scan viewer, it's going to take you here. We're going to go up a folder uh, into this low part SW folder, into this set folder. And here's where we're going to right click and drag this, either this RGF file or this RGF file, depending on whether you're coming from the thumb drive or the download. Right click and drag, drop it into this copy. It's telling me I've already got one named that. It's my old one, so I want to replace that. Same thing with this one if you've got, uh, if you're using the downloaded one. And we're done there. Uh, if we want to do that in X program, it's going to be the same. Right click on it, file location, open file location. Uh, except for this one, we're going to go down into the H scan folder, low part SW that and then right click and drag into this folder copy here you have X program you've also got um, this Glofo program that's your photogrammetry software it's also got a place you need to put this RGF file so we'll go back up to the scanner folder it contains both of these go into Glofo this one has mscan underscore set we're going to want to go into and replace that RGF file there as well. Uh, again, selecting to uh, overwrite if it asks you uh, whether or not you want to replace one with the same name. We've done that. We can go ahead and run. Oops, I've already got this open. Close that out. Run the scan viewer. If you've got your scanner hooked up, now you should see if you've been getting a license expired dialog, you should see what I'm about to see here in a moment. And the system is initialization complete, showing me that scanner uh, being recognized with a proper license by ScanViewer.